Whoa, Narancha Academy. Oh, I know that professor. Taking lessons from tradition, growing stronger and greater. It's time for you two to dive into the world of Pokemon. Who are you? Director Clavo, head of Naranja Academy. Paldia is a sprawling region bursting with lush nature and magnificent landscapes. It is also of course home to the mysterious creatures known to us as Pokemon. They reside in great numbers in fact. Oh, what is it gonna be? That is a... Uh, I don't know that one. Who the hell are you? But it's cute, so I'm gonna catch that thing. Pokemon can be found living all over in the seas, in the skies, even in our cities and towns. We humans coexist with Pokemon as we both help one another to live and thrive. Naranja Academy is here to help you learn even more about these precious partners. Within our halls, people from all regions gather to study together. Oh. Ooh. And the, oh. What's that Tauros? It's so black! And as Pokemon trainers, they have their Pokemon do battle growing alongside them. While our robust curriculum of coursework helps our students draw forth their foolish potential, it is within these halls that you will find your friends, your Pokemon, and your true self. We, the faculty and the staff at Naranja Academy can't wait to welcome you with open arms. Ooh. Whoa. Pokemon Scarlet! There's the Black Tarot's. <laughs> Is that a plane? No. Is that a bird? No. It's a... something. Deep dive. Whoa, that's gotta be a noob. Flying type Pokemon. Oh. Huh? Now saving. Oh. Right, auto save. <laughs> I guess that's my character. Get, get up. Okay. Oh, oh. Now saving. Okay, now how do I turn off the auto save? Auto save should be off. Uh, there. Would you like to save? Yes. Okay. Always do that when you're playing Pokemon. Hmm? <laughs> I thought this was a- I thought this was my little brother. But I guess not. Guess I'm supposed to pick this up. Your bag and hat are hanging here, but it's not time to get ready yet. Let's go downstairs. Okay. Ooh! There's the Nintendo Switch OLED. Dash. Mancha. I forgot the name of that Pokemon too. Uh, okay, first thing I need to do is talk to Mommy, right? Mommy, I'm about to go to an adventure. Where are you? Mancha. Okay. There you are. Good morning, Connie. Good morning. Oh, already in your uniform and everything. 
Well, it's your first day at your school, after all. I'm so excited for you. Still, you might want to cool your engines before you go racing out the door. The school contacted me and said that you're supposed to wait here a little while longer. Uh, their words, not mine. Apparently, there's something very important for your first day that still hasn't arrived. Ding dong. Maybe that's the very thing we're waiting for. Connie, get the door, would you? Sure. If I must. Mancha. Huh. Dash. Dash. <laughs> I don't know which one is the dash button. <laughs> Do forgive the intrusion. I didn't even open the door yet. You are Miss Connie, yes? On behalf of the Academy, I must apologize for the late arrival of your enrollment documents. And also for my delay in introducing myself. I am the director of Naranja Academy. You may call me Mr. Clavo. The director, and you came in person to help my daughter with her first day. Well, I am responsible for the entire Academy, including any failures on its part. Oh, <laughs> this guy is meeting all the students. Wow. So here I are here at last are the enrollment documents that should have already been delivered to you. Oh, I see. Goodness, you really needn't have. Since you've come all this way, can I at least offer you a cup of tea? Ah, oh, no need to trouble yourself. Connie, I've got a thing or two to discuss with the director here. Why don't you head back up to your room and finish getting ready for school? You'll need your bag and your hat as well. Now, Mr. Clavo, you simply must join me for a cuppa this way. Well, how can I refuse such a kind offer? <laughs> Forgive the intrusion. Oh, there they are. Uh, run, run. I cannot run. Ooh, look at this uh, flower pop Pokemon. Mm. Ah, here it is. Ready to put on your hat and grab your bag. Yep. Your adventure guide. You can press the X button to open the main menu. Select this. Select the save option from this menu to save all the progress you've made on your adventure. When you open up the bag, you'll find some key items inside, including your adventure guide. Check it out whenever you want to review handy tips like these that you receive along your adventure. Okay. Okay, I guess it's time to go. Let's go. Oh, just look at you, all ready for your big first day. Yes, the uniform of our storied academy suits you quite well indeed. Oh gracious, how very careless of me. I had entirely forgotten that I have something else for you, Miss Connie, a most important thing. But your living room is hardly the place for it. Would you care to follow me outside? I wonder what this important thing might be. Let's follow the director out and see, shall we? Ooh, that's gotta be my starter Pokemon. Let's go. Hmm? Right then, dear Pokemon, time to come out of your Pokeballs. Yes! Three! Haha! <laughs> uh, which one? We provide each student entering the academy a Pokémon of their own. I'll ask you to choose which among these three you'd like to have as your partner. Spirigatito, the grass cat Pokémon. That sounds like a ghost type. Oh, Okay, I think I'm gonna go with this one. Spur. Or maybe this one. Fue Coco, the Fire Croc Pokemon. Oh! Craw. And Quaxly, the Duckling Pokemon. 
Pump. They're all very good company. Why? They usually refuse to even leave my side. Oh. <laughs> What's this? Hmm, so it turns out they're more interested in you, Miss Connie, than familiar old me. Ah, oh, sad, sad old man. I do wish I could stay and see which one you'll choose, but I must be off to my next home visit. I'll be at the house just over there. Take your time with your decision, then come find me once your mind is made up. Now if you'll excuse me, until next we meet. Oh no, I can't decide. What a mannerly fellow that director of yours is. Director. These three are all lovely, but you need to choose the w just one, right? Not an easy task. They're telling me. Why not take this opportunity to walk about with these little ones and get to know them? I'm sure they have lots to teach you. Oh, but before you go, I got a little something to celebrate your big day. Take it with you if you're going out on your own. Rotom phone. Okay. You put the Rotom phone in your bag. The latest model of smartphone, a Pokemon called Rotom lives within it and it can be used to run all sorts of handy apps. It's a brand new phone. According to the instructions, you can check the map, map app by pressing the Y button. It'll help keeping you from getting lost, so take good care of your new gadget, okay? Now off you go. Have fun. Oh. Head to the house down the way. Check! The handy Rotom phone is a popular item used through the Paldea region. Adding apps to it gives the trainer access to a variety of useful informations. Using the map app, you can find useful information about the Paldea region. If you move the map cursor over your own icon and then move the right stick from side to side, you'll rotate your own view along with the map. Handy for getting yourself oriented. What? Okay. You can use the left stick to move, move the magnifying glass around the map and find locations. Select the location by pressing the A button and you can set it as your next destination. The flying taxi service can take you to some places you've visited before. <laughs> Places that you can fly to are indicated with a feather mark. Try taking a flight. Hey, it's not Corviknight anymore. Oh, it's some other Pokemon. Okay. So, I need to go here? Visit to the neighbors. Yeah, I'm guessing I need to go here. Set as destination. Let's go. Okay. Let's go, little guys. Hmm? <laughs> They're all following me. Oh, which one should I go with? <laughs> dash, dash. Let me try find the dash button. Oh? No, no. I'm not talking, talking to Ducky right now. I saw a Fletchling. Oh, now I can run. Welcome. Okay, let's ignore this lady for now. The power of science. Okay. Whose home is this? Oh, they're gone. Are you these three's trainer? Not yet. Not quite. Miss Connie has yet to make her choice, you see? Hey, she looks like a rival. I do wonder which of them she will choose. Whoa, the apple's all burnt. 
Oh no. I gotta make my choice. Buenas! We haven't met, have we? I must say, I wasn't expecting to see you here quite so soon. Hang on, character. Is this who I think it is? Yes, this is our academy's newest student, Miss Connie. She will be attending as of today. So you're that kid who who moved in up the road. I've been dying to find out more about you. I'm Nemona. Normally I live in the school dorms, but home is here. What do you say, new neighbor? Wanna be friends? <laughs> no. Uh. No. Yes, fine. Love that enthusiasm. We're gonna get along just fine. Miss Nemona is president of our school ca student council and a champion ranked trainer in her own right. I absolutely love Pokemon battling. In fact, we should battle right now, you and me. Easy now. You two will be in the same class, so you'll have plenty of time to battle later. And get to know one another better, of course. We're gonna be neighbors and classmates? Nice, we'll be able to battle all we want. On that note, Miss Connie. Have you decided which of these Pokémon you would like to be your first partner? Nope. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's go with a Hippopotamus. Now maybe it's a Crocodile, but... <laughs> it's a Crocodile. Craw? Oh, I'm happy I chose this one. He's so cute. That's Fuecoco, a fire-type Pokémon. The burning hot sparks it scatters will fry any and all plants in a flash. Would you like to go with our good fire type Pokemon Fuecoco here? Let's go, Fuecoco! <laughs> Yay! You chose Fuecoco. Would you like to give Fuecoco a nickname? No! Yes! Da -da -da. Fue Coco seems to have taken quite a liking to you, Miss Connie. This is your first Pokemon, yes? Please raise it with love and care. And of course, be sure to keep it tucked safely inside a Pokeball. Okay. My first Pokemon. Connie, I can't believe you actually chose Fue Coco. Why? <laughs> I mean, like... Way to make the perfect choice for you. You two make such a good combo. Can I choose one of these Pokemon too, Director Clavel? Oh, but did you not receive a Pokemon when you entered the Academy, Miss Nemona? Not back then, no. I had other Pokemon I was focusing on raising at the time. But now I want to raise a new Pokemon alongside Connie while she raises her own, own new partner. Indeed, a rather splendid idea. If you wish to raise one of these Pokémon on equal footing with Miss Connie, uh, I shall be more than happy to allow it. Yes! Okay. Oh, <laughs> since Connie chose Fue Coco, I'll go for this little one. Oh, nice to meet you, Spirigatito. Welcome to the team. Spur! Uh, maybe I should have chose that one. Oh well. <laughs> Alright then. Now that we've chosen our Pokémon, we have to battle. <laughs> I'll be waiting for you down at the beach. Come join me when you're ready. Down at the beach. As you may have noticed, Miss Nemona is a tad over fond, overly fond of Pokémon battling. But I do hope you'll join her for a battle. It'll help you to get know, uh, get to know your Pokémon as well. Okay, let's go battle Nemona. First Pokemon battle. Whoa, it's like a beach resort here. Over here! Yeah, I can see you. Anyone can be a Pokemon trainer as long as they have the have Pokemon by their side. 
And it's our death duty as trainers to help our Pokemon grow stronger. Ready to battle me? Uh, yep. Perfecto, I'm so excited. For this battle, I think I'll use... Miss Nemona. I trust you remember that Miss Connie is wholly inexperienced in Pokemon battling. Huh, whoops. Good call, Director. I was about to send out one of my usual partners right off the bat. I guess I'll take this chance to try out my new buddy instead. Come on, Connie. Let's let us have a fruitful battle. You are challenged by Pokemon Trainer Nemona. <laughs> Go, Fue Coco! Burn that cat. I know this is your first Pokemon battle, so let's just have some fun. Battle. Okay, battle. Hey, <laughs> I already have Ember. Ember time! Scratch! Uh-oh. That cat is fast. Yes, super effective. You must have been studying up. Smart move. Fire is strong against grass. Battle. Finish him! I wonder if my Fue Coco is a boy or a girl. Ember! Hey. Ember looks cooler now. Yes! My Fue Coco is a, is a boy. It's a man. Wow, not bad, neighbor. Yes, she gave me money. Look at you winning your first battle ever. You got even more potential than I thought. You're gonna be a strong trainer for sure. But now I want to try a different strategy. Let's go again. Just one more battle. Mm -hmm. Miss Connie and her Fue Coco are surely wary already from that last battle. No, we can still go. Ah, sorry. I got kind of caught up in all the excitement. I'm really sorry, Connie. Same to your Fue Coco, too. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Let's battle again soon. Oh, definitely. We'll definitely battle more. You two seem to be becoming fast friends, though you've only just met. Can I count on you to take your new schoolmate here under your wing, Miss Nomona? I'm sure she can learn a great deal from a champion-ranked trainer, just as yourself. You bet, sir. Oh, that reminds me. Since you're new to training Pokémon, there's an app you definitely need. You have a smartphone, right? Let me see it for a sec. Pokedex, all right. There's the Pokedex. Well, automatically register any Pokemon you catch. It's a must-have for Pokemon trainers. It's super handy app. Our homeroom teacher, Mr. Jack, actually made it himself. <laughs> Back in my day, we used ordinary paper and handwritten notes to compile our Pokedexes. It's quite the age we live in now. Oof. Filling out a Pokedex by hand, I can't even imagine how much work that'll take. Oh ho ho, no, I suppose you can't. Yet no matter how much the times may change, the wonder of meeting new Pokémon never does. That is a truly timeless pleasure. And the more Pokémon that you encounter, the more you'll find yourself growing and changing. I hope you will both work hard toward the goal of completing your own Pokedexes. Now, Miss Nemona, I do still have a few matters to discuss with your parents. But I depend on you to see Miss Connie to the academy. You would be doing me quite the favor. Of course, leave it to me. Then I leave her in your capable hands. Alright, little one, it's time you and I uh, were on our way. Boom. Maybe I ought to make a little more time to work on my Pokédex, along with all my battling. Oh, right. Speaking of Pokédexes, Connie, you probably never caught a wild Pokémon, right? I'll show you the ropes before I take you to the Academy. Come with me. Alright. 
time for catching tutorial. Opening your Pokedex. Press the minus to open the Pokedex app on your Rotom phone. You can also navigate your Pokedex by pressing the X button from the map app. Okay, follow Nemona. You're not going anywhere. Mm -hmm. Where'd she go? Mm -hmm. oh. oh, Connie. I hear that Nemona here will be taking you to school. That's right, ma'am. Leave it to me. So you've already managed to make a friend. <laughs> and I read about all the wonderful teachers you'll have looking after you at the school. Plus so many handy facilities you can use as much as you like. Add in your new friend Demona, and it sounds like your school life is shaping up to be fantastic. Now, you'll be staying in the school dorms, so I want you to promise me you'll eat proper meals. <laughs> Why is there never a daddy in the Pokemon games? Here's a bit of spending money to start off with. I also packed lunch for you your first day. You obtained the sandwich from mom. You put the sandwich your mom in your bag's key items pocket. A dish made by sandwich and bread it makes a fantastic meal. Okay. And maybe you'd better take these too. You obtained five potions. You put the potions in your bag's medicines. Okay. Potion. Use them on that precious little partner of yours should it get hurt in battle. I know every day in your new life is gonna be full of exciting experiences far from home. Just try to savor them all, the good times and the hard times, too. But if you ever want to come home, you know your bed is always ready for you. Alright then, you two had better be off, I suppose. Take care on the way to school. <laughs> She's such a smiley mother. Your mother's so nice, Connie. Oh, but I was going to teach you how to catch wild Pokemon. Come on, vamos! Now she's Spanish. This way! Okay, vamos. <laughs> she, she's leaving me so far behind. Follow Nemona. Poco Path. All right, this is a poker path. Whoa, what are those? It's the path that leads to adventure for you and me. Out here, things are different than in town. You're gonna see wild Pokemon out and about. They'll be on the path and in the grass and such. Get too close to one and you'll have to battle, but you've got Fuecoco for that, right? And if you want to try catch your Pokemon, you gotta use a good old Pokeball. I've got tons, have a few. You obtained five Pokeballs. Ah, oh, only five? You put the Pokeballs in your bag's Pokeballs pocket. A device for catching wild Pokemon is thrown like a... Okay, we all know what a Pokeball is. Oink, oink. Ooh, what luck. Time for some learning by doing. Try battling this Lechonk, Connie. Alright, Fue Coco. Ooh. <laughs> catching a Pokemon. You can try catching a wild Pokemon. You are battling by pressing X and throwing a Pokeball. Okay. When you're having a hard time catching a Pokemon, try deal damage. Okay. Deal damage, huh? You're only level 3. Battle. Mm, how about tackle? Ember might be too much. Oh, I can move the camera. Fue Coco's defense fell. One more tackle. Okay. Throw the ball. Two 
two, one. Yes, my first catch. We can try the ZR function. Oh, there's a flying one. Oh. <laughs> it didn't work. Uh, come back here. Okay. I get that. I get that flying thingy. No, it's gonna catch me. That pig. No, the, another pig's gonna catch me. Oh, it's a it's a fletchling. Oh. Wait, I want that flying Pokemon. Throw. Oops. How can I throw far away? Nope. Okay, you know what? I think I'll go just get a Fletchling then. You're mine! Yes! Okay, it's time for me to go out to get dinner. So I think what I'll do is like, you know, catch some of these Pokemon while I'm ordering dinner. So you won't see that part in the video. But yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah, see you later on. I'll just progress some of the story while, you know, <laughs> while I'm outside. All right, see you later. Okay. I stopped playing here because this part seemed important. Hey Connie, you getting the hang of how to catch Pokemon okay? Yep, I caught like five already. Uh, let me see, so far you've caught... Kukiao! Whoa, what was that? Uh, go! I've never heard that kind of cry before. Could be some strong Pokemon or something. Let me guess, Zacian and Zamazenta. I say we find whatever made that cry. Let's take a look around, Connie. Just be careful, there's a kind of unsafe cave not far from here, so steer clear. And I know your Rotom phone can keep help you safe, but help watch these steps by these cliffs anyway. Okay, terrible reading, but let's go. Hey, the grass. The grass looked better in Arceus. Ah, <gasps> it's that Pokemon that dropped into the ocean. He's hurt. Grr. Bow wow. Oh no, the cliff! That is too convenient, that function. Yipe yipe. <laughs> she must have like super arm strength to be able to not fall from that. Yipe yipe. Okay. Okay, Mr. Legendary, I've got you now. Okay, let's catch the Legendary. Or maybe not. You okay? The mysterious Pokemon seems to be too weak to move. <laughs> it's your chance to catch. Maybe you can give us something to help perk it up. Help it perk up. All right. Mom's sandwich. Where's mom's spaghetti? I don't got mom's spaghetti, so mom's sandwich. Select. How about a sandwich? You like sandwiches? Gia? Yeah. <laughs> sniff sniff. Comp. How many bites do you need to do on that sandwich? Ag yes. It's smaller than I thought. Oh. <laughs> that must be the dangerous cave. It still looks like a baby, yeah? Probably. Ah, uh, yes.
it didn't change. Oh, oh now it has a wheel. Wait, wait, she said. Wait, you didn't say thank you for the sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> 